Hello everybody. Now we are going to convert a logic diagram into a multiple level NAND circuit. So this is shown in the figure 4.4 from Digital Design by Maurice Mano's 5th edition. And our question number is 3.22. Actually this is the logic diagram for BCD to XS3 code converter and the Boolean expression is given here as I said is equal to D dash, Y is equal to C D plus C dash D dash, X is equal to B dash C plus B dash D plus B C dash D dash and W is equal to A plus B C plus B D. Like that it is given and the basic logic diagram, the logic diagram using basic gates is also given. It is our task to convert this logic diagram into a multiple level NAND circuit. Okay, let's get started. So here the first one it is D is converted to D dash using this inverter, right? So this inverter can be converted as NAND. Then it's okay. Then here we have this B and C are given as input to this AND gate. So it is CD. So here if you add a bubble then it becomes NAND gate for compensation you have to put a bubble here. Okay, we got one more NAND gate here. This is okay, this is okay. This OR gate must be converted into NAND gate. So for that we have to add a bubble at the in input side, right? So in order to compensate that here you can add inverter with the help of NAND like that we can do this so this is also converted into NAND then come over here this should be converted as NAND like this inverter as NAND this is okay already one input line is having bubble the other input line must be given a bubble so what we can do here we can add an inverter in this part so adding a bubble here we get this NAND gate so here also you have to add a bubble to compensate. Here you can add a bubble. So this becomes NAND. But adding a bubble is compensating it. That means this also becomes a NAND gate. So here you can convert this like this. I think that okay, this is okay. Then you are going to convert this as NAND gate. Like this. That means compensating here. Okay. So this input line if you put a bubble. Then you have to add a NAND gate as an inverter then it's okay so we have converted everything now we'll draw the circuit so it is D and C then this is being taken out and here we have the inverter using NAND so that our output is set here good then from here we take the connection and this is made as NAND gate and the next input is here so this is over okay this line is taken here you have a NAND gate it means bubble door can be replaced by a NAND gate so that your output is Y what's the next input it comes from here and you need a inverter for this that is also drawn using this NAND gate like this okay then here we start from here this point so to this we are adding an inverter using NAND gate and from here also we take the connection from C and adding an inverter using NAND gate and these two are given to another NAND gate because bubble door is equivalent to NAND then this is given to one NAND gate so from here we can take the connection and it is given to a NAND gate so we and at this point also we have to take a connection right from here yes then this B line is given here yes so uh, and this is actually given to one another NAND gate and from the B line another connection is taken and it is given to an inverter which is a NAND gate and then this is given to this NAND gate then the connection from here is extended to given it to another NAND gate so this point is extended okay okay right fine so this NAND gate 
input is given as input to another bubble door circuit that means it is in NAND gauge so the output is here x then this line is given as input to this NAND gate this NAND gate output is taken and here from A we take the line and it is given to one NAND gate for inversion and then it is given as input to another NAND gate that's it here we get it as double so we have done this okay so what it is it is BCD2 XS3 port converter using multiple level NAND gates NAND gates only Thank you. Hope you have understood.